guys, welcome to another Cook With Me. You guys, it has been a minute since we have done a Cook With Me, so I'm excited for this recipe. We are doing a honey lemon chicken with angel hair pasta. Mm. Super good for you, super delicious. I can't wait to try it. I love anything lemon, so I think this is gonna be super delicious. So let's get started. Okay, so for this recipe, you're gonna need four chicken breasts. I did three because I have the big Costco one. So I did three chicken breasts, Cut, cube them up, make them into cubes. And then you're gonna want a half a cup of honey, a fourth a cup of lemon juice, which we're gonna squeeze fresh lemons, two tablespoons of olive oil, one tablespoon of apple cider vinegar, um, a, a tablespoon of lemon pepper seasoning, which is like my favorite. I love lemon pepper. Half a teaspoon salt to taste or and black pepper and angel hair pasta, that's it. Since the pasta takes the longest to cook, we are going to start the pasta, and then once that gets started, I will show you guys the sauce that's gonna be mixed into the chicken. Okay guys, so I'm gonna drop the angel hair pasta into the water, and then we also have some corn on the cob cooking, which I love. We're gonna let that cook, get that soft. Angel hair pasta cooks pretty fast, because it's so thin, so we're gonna get started on the sauce right now for the chicken. All right, so we are going to add for the sauce, this is the, the stuff that's going in the chicken, we are going to add a half a cup of honey. So that's quite a bit. We're gonna have to squeeze this till it hits half a cup. Maybe I should take the lid off. All right, that was a lot faster. All right, so we're gonna do half a cup of honey. Boom, that's half a cup. All right, so we got half a cup of honey here that we're just gonna pour in a medium-sized bowl. That's a whole lot of honey. We're using raw honey, so I think it's better for you. I don't know. I think it's, I heard it's only better when it's like the local. raw honey from local. Okay, so, and then we're gonna do a fourth of a cup of lemon juice, and we're gonna just squeeze the fresh lemons because I love lemons. All right, fourth of a cup. We got our handy dandy thingamajig. It's from Susie Baker. Yes, I love this thing. We use it all the time. We're gonna squeeze these until we get a fourth of a cup of lemon juice. Which Whoa. is quite a bit. All right. That's a juicy lemon. The thing I like about this thing too is like no seeds get in, which is so nice. Ready? Boom. That's good. So that took about a lemon and a half. And just kidding, some seeds did get in. Uh. <laughs> All right, honey and lemon. We're gonna add the lemon in there. Oh shoot, it smells so good, I love lemon. This looks like medicine for one big cough. Oh, that's true, that's what you do for your coughs. Yeah, comment down below if this is a, a, a concoction that you make up when you have a cough or a sore throat if you combine lemon and honey. I do and I love it. Okay, so then after this, you're gonna do two tablespoons of the olive oil. All right, so two tablespoons olive oil, boom, and boom. And I never even knew that we had a, a red slap and spray. Yeah, we got that from Inez, actually. Oh, wow. How Inez rolls, she got all like new utensils, so she's like, hey, do you want this? I'm like, uh, yeah, we love our slap and spreads. Nice. So, got that one for my Nez. It's nice and red. We're gonna call that one red hot. Red hot slap and spread, yikes. We are going to add the apple cider vinegar, and I'm using the one with the mother because that one is the healthy one, or supposedly supposed to be the most healthy. So, here we go. We got one tablespoon apple cider vinegar. And then we're gonna do, I believe it was one tablespoon of the lemon pepper. So, I love this stuff, you guys. This stuff is so good. I've never had lemon pepper. And I don't I've even actually, know what it's on. Oh. What have you had it on? I've had it on, chi mainly chicken. I've had it on white rice. It's so good with just white rice and then lemon pepper. I haven't bought it forever, like forever, ever. I used to eat it a lot, like, growing up. What song is that where it says, Forever, ever, forever, ever. What is that song? <laughs> forever, ever? Some rapper. 
I don't know, but I do like Tina's headband. Oh, shoot. You guys, I did nothing. Today was laundry day, so I did a ton of laundry today and literally just was scrubbing out today. So, sorry, didn't dress up for you guys. There we go. So we got that, and then it just says to season it with salt and pepper. So I'm just gonna do a little bit of salt. Mm, that smells good. A little bit of pepper, salt and pepper, get it? Salt and pepper. Remember the singers? Yeah. All right, so there is that. Okay, you guys, so that's it for the sauce. So it smells super delicious, mainly because of that lemon. But I'm gonna just, you're just gonna stir this up, stir it all together, boom, boom, boom. And then we're gonna set that aside for just a minute Ooh. while we get the chicken grilling. Grilling? Grilling. Grilling. Is that gonna be enough for our family? Oh yeah. Well, this is just the sauce. No, I'm talking the chicken right there. Oh yeah, because it has the pasta. Oh, okay. So hopefully, I'm sure it will be though. Okay, we're gonna get going on the chicken. We're just gonna add about a tablespoon of olive oil, which that looks about right, right there. And then we're gonna let that warm up a little bit and then we're gonna add the chicken to it. And then I'll show you what we're gonna do. Okay, gonna add the chicken to this olive oil. Love that sizzle. Boom. So you're gonna cook that until it's about 90% done, it says. So um, so basically almost done, because I think it cooks a little bit with the pasta. So oh, okay, that makes sense. So to this chicken, it says to generously sprinkle more lemon pepper. I'm nice. so excited. So look at that! I love Ooh. lemon pepper. That seems generous enough. Oh yeah. Right? Flavor those babies up. Look at that. Take so. out the wooden chocla and smack them around. Boom. Look at that. Oh my gosh. It smells so good with that lemon pepper. Ooh. I'm going to do a little bit more. I was just going to say, side. I wonder if you could be a little more generous. I think I can. All right. Ooh. -wee. Yum. So we're going to let that chicken cook up till it's like not pink anymore. And then we will add the sauce and then the pasta. Mm, it's going to be good. Okay, so chicken is pretty much cooked through here. Smells so good. Oh. Ethan, come over here and smell this, dude. It's gonna smell even better once we add this delicious sauce. Oh. Are you guys making, what are you guys making? It's a lemon, chicken, honey, right, right. pasta, delicious, amazing. I smelled it from over there, that was really good. <laughs> Smells good, huh? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna pour the sauce on, and this, I'm gonna say, is probably the most satisfying thing ever. Here we go. And then you're gonna turn it down to medium heat after you do this. Ooh, look, look at, that. at that, you guys. Are you? Instantly, I think of the oh. Olive Garden dressing being poured on the chicken. Oh yeah, but this is totally different. Wow. Look at that, just marinating that chicken. Oh man, that looks amazing. Look at that. We're just gonna soak all that chicken in there. Oh dang. That looks good. Yeah, so make sure you're back down to a medium heat and you're just gonna kind of cook it till it um, bubbles a little bit. And then we will add the pasta. All right guys, so chicken's ready, pasta's ready. So basically what you're gonna do now is just add. Ooh. Are you running a race? I was doing motorcycle. I'm messy here. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so we're gonna just, I'm gonna add a little bit at a time because I don't know. Ow. Oh, I'm sorry. What the heck? Mmm, <laughs> that tastes good though. <laughs> I was just trying to get you to try it. A little piece jumped oh, off and shoot, burnt sorry. me. Okay, I'm gonna add more pasta. So for the pasta, you want eight ounces. I feel like I did uh, maybe a little more than eight ounces, so that's why I'm adding just a little bit at a time here. Just to make sure. You know me. Boom, Ooh. look at that. Soaking up nicely in this amazing sauce. Look at that. Are you kidding me right now? Wow, that looks really good. Yeah, I think we could do a little more pasta even. And I already checked this uh, angel, hair, angel hair pasta with chicken. I checked it out on my um, my fitness pal Ooh. and it's 400 calories. Okay. So I've got about a little over so 800. Bad. I've got about a little over 800 um for dinner and so i've got to see if that's like for a cup or two cups or what 
to see how much how much I can have. Yeah, you guys. like this. Honestly, you guys, this isn't bad for you. And like you, like if you guys have seen our previous vlogs, you know we're trying to be a little bit more healthy. So this is not our cheesy wheezy, super crazy. <laughs> Even though we are still going to have those we'll meals. We still have those because we're all about moderation. So it's balance and portion control. Yep. Exactly. So this will be delicious for this evening. And then we're going to couple it with a salad and some corn on the cob. Nice. That sounds delicious to me. Okay, guys, here it is. Check it out. That's dinner. Boom. Look at that. And not even that hard, you guys. Like, so easy. I'm going to taste it right here, right now. We're going to sit down as a family and eat some, but I want to taste it for you guys here real quick. So, oh shoot, and then we've got to get some of that chicken. Here we go. Mm. Good? That is so good. What, what do you taste most mm. out of the flavoring? The lemon and the honey together is so bomb. Wow. Oh, it's so good. What do you think? This do you, could be a new fave. What do you think, uh, how do you think the kids will react to it? I like it. Should we yeah. have him try it real quick? Yeah, we will. Okay. All right, Danny's gonna dig in and have a little bite here. All right. And I'm counting this as a freebie. I'm not counting this on my. Yeah. Yeah, that's totally a freebie. Mmm. Really good. For me, totally taste the lemon and the honey, like you said. Mm-hmm. I need something toasty with it. Oh no, Danny and his crunch. No, but otherwise, like honestly, it's really, really good. Like I, the flavor is amazing, yeah, right? It's very good. It's very flavorful. Mm. I'm telling you, this is going to be a new staple. I'll tell right. you that right now. If the kids like it, I'm making it all the time. Yeah, this is really good. Oh man. Mm. So what's a what's something crunchy you could put on there, or maybe just have it with toast like and butter. Crumbs. Oh, breadcrumbs would be good, too. Those breadcrumbs sprinkled on, I'd be good. Yep. You know Danny, he likes his crunch. Mm. All right, so let's see. Ethan, go ahead and try it. Did you try chicken? Mm -hmm. What are your thoughts? What are your thoughts? That's pretty good. Pretty good? Oh. I can taste the honey, though. So you have honey for your allergies anyway. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, so what are you... Are you going to still want more? Yeah. Yeah? Excellent. All right, MZ, your turn. <laughs> Maybe your tooth will come out. Oh. You can have it with the pasta too. Did you taste the honey? Mm. I would rate that a 10 if it didn't have the honey. So what do you rate it with the honey? Um, I'll do like maybe Six. Okay. <laughs> oh, ow. We are nice. learning our kids' feelings about honey. Yes. Elijah, yeah, let's go ahead. Plenty, let's go ahead and have some, bud. Here we go. Here's Elijah. I actually don't mind honey. Nine out of ten. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good boy. Do you have the chicken yet? Or you yeah. just have the pasta? Just had the pasta. Just try the chicken. Chicken, 8 out of 10. Pasta, 9 out of 10. Nice. Oh, man. You know if it's not a 1,000 out of 10, it's not up to par. <laughs> I think it's up to par. Now it's Brayden's oh, turn. Brayden. Here we go. Here we go. Stop. Stop. <laughs> yeah, it's good. How good? 10 out of 10. Oh! Here you guys, check that out. That dinner looks amazing. The corn on the cob is amazing. I'm not corn good. on the cob is the best. Yeah, I was just watching Emberlyn try to eat it with her tooth. Let's show everyone your tooth again for those who haven't seen it. Oh my gosh, just take one good bite in there, Emberlyn. Yeah. If you pull it out, oh. For those of you wondering where Ashlyn is, she is at a swim party right now, so. And I will say, the next time I make it, well, I don't know. It was gonna be a staple till I saw the kids' reaction. Oh, it's so, a staple. Okay, it's They're a gonna... staple. But I don't think I'll. I was gonna say that maybe we, I could make more the next time, but I'm thinking they probably won't finish all that they have, so I think we'll be good. I guarantee you, right now with these two, if you sprinkled Parmesan cheese on top of it, they would be fine with it. Oh, Ethan's eyes got big. <laughs> yeah. All right, you guys. So that's it. We all 
kind of gobbled that up. The kids were not that into it, which is okay, sometimes that happens. I just hate it when I love a recipe and they don't love it because then I probably won't make it as often. But honestly, you guys, I really loved it. I'm gonna say the overwhelming flavor of it was the honey. Wouldn't you say? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, because the kids, they all tasted the honey. Everyone tasted the honey. So if you don't like honey or lemon, you probably won't love this recipe. But if you love that combo, you will love this recipe because it was delicious. And you I can personally loved it. And you could make it for the kids. Just it, um, you could put the lemon, pep le lemon pepper seasoning on it and everything. That's and true. then make a side of Alfredo sauce. Oh, yeah. And then we could just, we will pour in. Yeah, the, um, that's true. We could totally alter it to how they might like it, and then we have it the regular way. So that might be what we do. But honestly, really good, really easy. I actually really loved it. So. You, I, I actually felt somewhat. I know it wasn't extremely healthy, but like I felt good eating it. Like it was a like it, it was, was a good like, meal. That was a good source of protein. It didn't yeah. have a lot of crap in it. I mean, maybe the pasta was a lot of carbs, but if you just watch your portions, you're good. Yeah. You just got to watch your portions. And the my fitness app has been awesome with keeping us on track on that so yeah. i think we did pretty good not bad we had a salad and some corn on the side i'm gonna say for us you guys know our cook with me's this was pretty dang healthy yeah. <laughs> pretty dang good so that's it you guys so thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you haven't already like this video and we'll see you guys tomorrow Standing underneath the lights Look into each other's eyes